gonna call my dad right now. Let's see if he answers. He don't like me. Dad. Yeah. Remember two years ago when um one of my videos hit 6,000 views and I told you and I was dummy excited and you told me, so when are you gonna start making money from it? Yeah. What do you gotta say about now? I love you. I'm gonna talk to you later. Okay. Bro, I remember that shit. It was yesterday. No, I got 5,000 views in like four days a week. A week. And I'm over here flipping out like I just hit the lottery. I was in a very dark place. Like, I did not know where I was gonna go. Like, I was stuck neck deep in mud and I got pulled out. And I give all praises to him because I feel like whenever I don't put him first, that's when the most shit in my life happens. But there's just moments in our lives where we all have to sit back and be, wow, how did I get out of this place where I thought I was gonna be trapped forever? And in my personal view, I just give all praises to the most high because I feel like he's the one that does get me out of those situations. <laughs> I have 5 million subscribers, mom. Congratulations. Five more next to <laughs> Alright, love you guys. I feel you. I cried. <laughs> you cried. She asked, she said, if you guys were to die right now, would you go to heaven or would you go to hell? I had to be honest with myself. I like had to look into myself and I was like, the way I'm living right now, if God was to take my breath away right now, I'm going to hell. I'd be letting so many worldly things dictate how my day's gonna go, you feel me? You got people out here that are battling cancer, like, you know, being victims of horrible crimes and all kinds of stuff, right? and they still have the ability to put a smile on their face and be genuinely happy. But the one thing I think that haunts me the most is one of my most popular pranks was, was whenever I snuck into the Gatorade HQ. But what a lot of you guys don't know is three people lost their jobs because of me. Because I lied and was saying that I worked there, I got three security officers fired that had been working there for years, all because I wanted to play a practical joke all because I want to entertain you guys. And that's evil. That truly is evil. And to those people that I got fired, um, I'm sorry. I truly am. I thought I wasn't gonna cry. I cried. <laughs> I cried much. I just said I wasn't gonna cry much. All the shoes, we're gonna give it to a local charity out here in Houston. Like this is my first time doing something like this big and just seeing like their smile of them getting their new shoes, like something that like we take for granted. That's a blessing. I wanna do more stuff like this and I appreciate you guys for rocking with me and supporting because you guys made it happen. I felt so bad, it was just so chaotic. Oh, no, that was great. Just turned my life around. Nah, bad as you. I appreciate you for being so cool. Yeah. I love getting messages from kids from back home in Ireland saying that they're putting their kids back into art college and stuff. They've inspired kids to start drawing again and inspired oh, wow. back into their art. And I mean, that just means the world to me. The world to me. I'm so all because of you, bro. I appreciate you. I want to give you five thousand dollars just so you can do your no, thing. No, 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 I can't take that. That's no, 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 of course I got you. I got you, dude. Are you serious? I'm serious. I'm serious. It's all good. It's all good. Your chat might turn against you, and your Discord might turn against you, but at the end of the day, bro, there's people in your chat and in your stream right now that are really looking up to you, man. And you gotta look at it like this. You know, a lot of people hate watching you right now. You feel me? Yeah. Like, it's not all love in there. Yeah. You know, there's a lot of snakes. They gotta yeah. it like this. They want to see you fall and crumble. So, you know what? Don't give them that option. I appreciate that, brother. You literally got me through a really hard time. Um, do you need help? You good? Here, I'll go get you a cart. I'll be right back. Here, you sit down. I got you. I don't know why, but I just literally love old people. No problem. What's your name? Your Lord. Oh, you look beautiful. <laughs> Thank you. No problem. Have a nice day. Here, I got you guys. No, no, you guys are giving us a ride. No, no, no. Ugh, take that out. Take it out. Uh, yeah, take that. Take that shit out. Oh, actually, here I have some cash. On. Here's a. Uh, here's eighty dollars. No, I'm not taking that. No, go. Oh, man, here. All right, here, just got me up there. Well, thank you guys. I'm from the, the bottom, 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 bottom of my heart, bro. Thank you.
I cannot thank you guys enough, man. I, bro, I didn't know what I wanted to do my, with my life. I didn't know what direction I wanted to go in. And you guys, you guys changed that.